Alright, you know the drill. Jump, jump. Okay, we're good on that front. Now, hang on. Uh, sound balance, checking, tangling. Oh god! That's like a... Yeah, it sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. Now just to switch. Switch, switch. Switch. The switch which I switch. Maybe I could find some way to automate this, I don't know. I gotta think I gotta start thinking with the big brain. Okay. So last time. Mario was framed for a crime he didn't commit. And uh, we gotta, you know, oh, we already figured out who did it though. It was uh, Bowser's son, who we have absolutely never seen before. Totally new character. Oh, out that he definitely isn't in a Mario game that just came out. Never seen him. Still, I'm sorry, just still adjusting the volume on my end. I keep thinking, oh, this is good, and then I'm like, no, I want it, I want it quieter. All right, so I'm just gonna go to White Hills, White Hill Zone. I sprayed it. I didn't need to spray it. We've established I didn't need to spray it, but I sprayed it anyway. Red coins of Windmill Village. Oh, I can definitely attest that it doesn't always have to be sunny to be hot. Oh yeah, let's get some let's get some red coins in the windmill village. Which is this? I I believe this it's this right here, coin. Red coins all over the place, aren't they? Weird. Yes, sir. Maybe I should go for the 100 coin in this mission as per tradition, but I'm not sure. It's hard to tell which ones would be the best ones with which to do this. There's a... Uh, a nozzle that I don't... I ain't got. Does that count as a coin? If that doesn't count as a coin, then my coin is entirely moot. Yeah, that's the one thing, I, as I said last stream, that I'm not crazy about with Mario Sunshine. <clears throat> is just how rigid the structure is compared to it. Yeah, it doesn't count as an actual coin, so never mind. Everything I have just said is entirely pointless. Oh well. So we can we just don't we don't have to worry about that then. So we can just, you know, handle this at our leisure and you know wet wet this uh sail kind of thing with windmill women 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 windmill sail. 
Don't worry, I'm just having a little stroke, just a little bit. You know, you could wait for that to turn, but unfortunately, uh, I don't know if I'm going to live to 97, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, <laughs> go this way. And also there's a blue coin over there I've spotted. So you know what it is that we must do. I don't know if I can actually make it over there. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I might have to come back with the rocket nozzle. Oh, spoilers, there's a rocket nozzle. Whoops, my bad. <laughs> they get all full of water and then they go boom. Like so. But like I said, on the flip side, if you're watching this channel in the first place, you probably played Mario Sunshine like six times yourself. So, oh well. But, but my bad. Okay, I need to rejuvenate my water. I don't actually need to yet, but I want to get that out of the way. Oh man, I should have done a wall kick, but I'm still okay. I'm still alright. Oh, I've fallen down. But I'm still alright. And there's one up there. And there's one over there. Which is the last one. Now, what direction was I again? Gotta get to the top of the city, the town city. And avoid uh, annoying uh, cyclone man. Uh, yeah, you, you are, you're who I was talking about. Yeah, get out of here, punk. Uh, I keep going in the wrong direction. My control over Mario is too fine. All right, now the tightrope sequence begins. I might just go ahead and clean up Bianco Hills because I'm just tired of looking at this place. I'm just sick of it. Holy manicotti. Petey Piranha strikes back. Okay, I might not actually finish it. I don't know. But I'm playing this mission. Alright, let's go. Let's go. There's goop everywhere again. That tends to be how most of this game goes, is that there's goop everywhere again. Mind your own business, Googles. Oh, I thought he was mad at me for a moment. And then stupid old Petey Piranha starts being alive again. So we gotta go... Kill. Oh, but not before we slide on that. Oh, 
Yeah, and uh, that thing I did last mission may just... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. The thing we did last mission was kind of a tutorial for this mission. Sort of. Yeah, click the stick, click it. Yep, yeah, yeah, R button. Is there something up here? Yep, there's a blue coin. Gotta get it. Come on. Mario. Come on, Mario. I need you to do this one simple thing. This one thing, Mario. Alright, get out of here. Get out of here. And just think, with goop physics like this, Splatoon could have existed several generations before it actually did. Get, get bopped. Okay, I'm missing ever so, ever so sick. There you go. Alright, let's let's deal with this guy again. But first let's go rejuvenate our water. I'm sure that won't be a problem. Now where'd he go? Where are you? Where are you, buddy pal? Oh, he's over there. And he's got new moves. But yet the same old weakness. Cover some health real quick. Clean this guy off real quick. Oh, good. Googles. Googles. Get some of this goop out of here, because it's seriously, it's giving me the irritation. Probably what you're supposed to do, but... But little do they realize you can just, uh, kind of do that, too. Can't see. Alright, since this is a video game, it takes three hits. Y 
You know, I'm think, thinking about it. It's kind of implying that uh, Bowser Jr. created him. So then, I mean, he keeps coming back in later games, and he's apparently not made out of paint there, so I don't know what the deal is with that. Maybe it was based on a real treasure map, a piranha plant. Okay. What's the next one? The secret of the dirty lake, so we get more secret level. Except it's not very secret at all, considering that the game is telling us right now where it is. Alright, the lake is filthy. We gotta do something about it by going in a random cave. That I can do. No reward. This man is so ungrateful. Alright. Just random, like, gopher turds falling from the tree. Me being entirely reckless with how I am playing this game. Uh, blue coins aplenty. Which I must now detour in order to get... Get them blue coins. Gotta get that blue money. Not quite a purple coin, because that's one game later. Come on, gimme, 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 gimme. Ah! Come on, I need to go up. Need to go up. There we go. No! Mario! Mario, your trapeze moves are sick, but I am not in the mood for them. Okay. How do I stop? How do I make this stop? Well, not like this, that's for sure. Mario, stop. Cease. Cease. Okay, there we go. Alright. Mission coin. Is there a coin over, like, those ways? It doesn't look like it. Yes! Okay. Ugh, you know, just clinch every muscle in my body. N not, not just any one. Just every single one. Now, if I remember right, I think if you go over here... Yeah, there you go. Completely avoid the uh, the lily pad that you're actually supposed to do this mission with, and we get a new nozzle for the first time. We get the turbo nozzle, or at least in this level we do, and immediately have it taken away.
All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's get this bread. Let's get this lasagna. Yeah, got it. There's no long jump, so you got to do a thing like that. Oh, I look down at the chat. I shouldn't have. I really should not have looked down at the chat. I should wait until like I'm in an actually safe place to do that, all things considered. Oh well, you live and you learn. You know, I, I think I did remember that it rotated, but I for some reason thought, eh, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I won't die to this. But you know what they say about overconfidence. Yeah, see. If you're not paying attention, then that's the old spicy keychain right there. I should not have made that jump, but I did again, and now I'm, uh, now I'm alright. <laughs> this thing rotates at very uncomfortable angles. I can see, like, right here, I can look at the chat. Yeah, see? Nobody said anything in the meantime, but I was able to look at the chat safely because there was no rotating cue. <laughs> that jump did not work. I mean, I gotta do this part again. Yo, know, let's try getting to this cube a different way this time. That did not work. <laughs> My control over Mario, while fine, is not absolute. <laughs> Egg salad! Good thing Mario is wearing his extra traction shoes today. <laughs> Alright, let's see if this will work this time. I tried to jump before. I must have pressed it a bit too late. See, like that. See, that's what you want to do. There we go. Shine. 
And I mean, we're almost done with this level. I, I will, I think I will fin just finish it up. Shadow Mario on the loop. Okay, so... It's kind of spoilers, but not really. In order to get to the ending of the game, you have to beat Mission 7 in every level. So, as a result, most of the Shine Sprites are mandatory, <laughs> unlike in Mario 64. With only, typically only, uh, Mission 8 being an optional one. Also, I guess maybe it's because it's pressurized, but, uh, it's funny how that water is fine, but he can't take this water. Where'd you go? That maneuver was incredibly pointless. But he'll remember this. Luckily, that mission is a whole lot of nothing. <laughs> so... But you have to beat the other missions to get to it. Oh, hang on, let me, uh... Let me close off my Twitch stream and then pull up OBS. I didn't realize I had not. Okay, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Dang it, chair! I heard my computer, like, s sliding ac across the desk, and I was like, Oh, this is, th this is the, uh, this is the day that I die. Oh, and there's the rocket nozzle. Which means we can finally get that blue coin we saw earlier, if it's in this mission. So was there something up here? I can't remember if I checked already. Oh, there's this guy. The dirty man. Is he the one who gives me a reward? Yeah, see, this guy... This guy knows it what it is I want. So since this is the last mission of this level, it probably would be a good idea to just go whole hog and try to get the uh, 100 coin zzz <laughs> coinables yeah and you have access to whatever you need in this level I mean I'll give it a shot at least but you definitely want to go over here stomp the false flowers of course Okay, now help, hold on a minute while I, I fumble with these flowers. Okay, there we go. Oh, they're in trouble. I'm always after those kids to tell me where they're going. But you know, they never do. Children are such little hoodlums. Some things just never change. Um, excuse me, ma'am. I am in need of blue currency. Can you can you give that another go? Not quite. I can probably get it on my own. Ah, uh, so the 100 coin shine is like an out of level experience here but nonetheless it will be done probably if not I'll just come now <laughs> Give corn. Give corn. There we go.
And also there's this. Where does this one go? Uh, somewhere else. Is it on the other side of this building? What? Where am I? Oh no, it's uh, over over there. It's over. Th it's over there. And of course, it is my prime directive to get these coins, so I must. All right, there we go. There's that one. And now we must slide to victory. Much slower than I was hoping. No, 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 okay. <laughs> Scared for a moment, but it ended up okay. I don't actually know if I'll be able to get 100 coins, but I'm, I'm giving it a, a shot. Either way, we'll clean up some of the blue coins. At least we got that going for us. I know those butterflies hold the secret to even more coins. But not through spraying them. I just only hope that the man that I need to help me is here. I should probably go check that first thing before I get too involved in this. There's only one man for a job this big. If I were to find such a man here, where would I find him? Okay, cool, cool stomp. I don't know where I would look, honestly, to figure out if he is around. I'm, there's a possibility that I maybe should have done a different mission first. Yeah, I, I have a feeling though he's not here. So let's just let's just do the red coin mission for now, and we'll have to come back. No, you know, actually, actually, I take it back. Let's just let's just exit the area when we when we have the fellow that we need to do this job, we will come back. Here, let's go to Pinnell Park. We did one mission on that last time. <laughs> the Beach Cannon Secret. Hello, uh, Copperamo. Uh, 
Out of nowhere, some weird thing took over my place. And now these explosives are flying everywhere. Please, you must help me. Oh, actually... There's some things we probably want to do with them first. Not involving uh, hitting that guy with a missile. Yeah, like that. Now, isn't there one over here? I Yes, there is one. There's some blue coins on the... One over here. I probably need to, like, help them out here, or otherwise they're gonna ram into the wall like, like that. Come on, give me the purple. Well, almost dead or not, I got the coin. And there's some coins hidden in here, though, in case you need them. Digging for buried treasure on the beach. Digging for buried fruit on the beach. Oh, blast it all. I literally, literally blast it all. Ooh, and you can destroy... You can destroy them with liquid in order to achieve coin. Control to Major Tom. I'm very bored. Hurry up with your bomb. What are those flowers saying? We may never know for sure. I got greedy there. Oh no, he was hiding in, he was hiding in there the whole time. He was waiting for me. Now welcome to Yoshi's Island World. Oh. <laughs> That's what I get when I try to play cool. What I get. Oh, 
Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Probably. I mean, go over here to see these guys. Don't you love them? Look at him. Look at him go. This is basically the closest thing you're gonna get to a Goomba in this game. The Entourage. Alright, entouraging over. And now Mario must jump on trampolines backwards. And fail. He is a true Olympic gymnast, he is. Here, come on, get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Okay, I'm gonna wait for them to rejuvenate themselves. Okay, now we go. Using the fastest means of travel I have available. All right, all right. And now that we have given Mario severe Indian burn on his uh, torso, we can go back and do another mission. Red coins of the pirate ship. And now we can explore the park proper, not chasing after uh, me but darker anymore. And then there's those guys for some reason. Okay, bye. Goodbye. Yellow button. The coin button. So we just kind of want to explore the park a little bit. Now where does this one go? Oh, it goes all the way over there in the next country. Alright Mario, we can maybe get there if you didn't bang your head on fruit! All right, cool, Mario. <laughs> Mario dies a painful death. But we must all suffer sometimes for money. Okay, once we get every blue coin in the universe, then we can actually play the game. Oh no, I had it. I had the speed.
And this one's kind of tight, honestly. You know, if I was smart, what I would do is stand over here and spray it. So I might get a little bit extra time. There we go. I just gotta do that the other way. most monotonous stream of my life but at least we get to see the stew stack why did they do that I don't know let's ruin their fun oh for a blue coin though and for a blue coin even murder is excusable <laughs> okay now we must gain vertical vertical height as opposed to horizontal height horizontal height is not what we need not what we need Kong Press this bird into money. Where did it go? Where did it drop? Where did it drop? Okay. I don't really have anything to say regarding what you what you did, what you just did in this chat. So I'm not gonna say anything. Crap, I just did. Well, henceforth, I will say nothing. Come on, Mario, do the do the jump, do the jump, do the jump. Yes, right there. You see that? You see that? That's that's why we needed to do the jump. But exactly how much is a blue coin worth in shroot bucks? How many goober dollars it's worth. Ah oh, yes, the plate. I have one at the top of every theme park. And yes, I did just imply I own a theme park. <laughs> this statement may not be accurate, but it is what I said. Don't worry guys, we're... Don't worry old man, we're almost to your room. 
Uh, we're, we're almost done with the blue coins, I think. We can probably stop worrying about blue coins soon. As soon as I get that one that's up there. Now see, there's one over there. Let's jetpack over to it. Okay, Electro Koopas, this ain't gonna work, so I'm going to have to knock you into outer space. Note, Electro Koopa died on the way back to its home planet. Roller Coaster Tycoon is a good game. A very nice time for your Windows 95 PC. I <laughs> landed right on it. Yes! Oh, and then there's one in there. You gotta, like... You gotta do some wackiness or something. Some some variant of uh, wackiness or just using your jetpack. I considered uh, streaming Roller Coaster Tycoon at some point. I don't know how how fun I would be able to make that, but it's a it's a quality game with many creativity options. Okay, whatever you say, Mario. I need that coin. That's all. That's all that. Come on, give, give me, give me the coin. Now, Copperama, don't you be like. Trying to search for like pro Jared nudes on my stream. That is certifiably not allowed. Not to mention, not particularly effective. There we go. Where did that spawn again? I saw it, but I already forgot. Oh, it's up here. <laughs> no comment on that one. You missed that one. Try another! Okay, cool. <laughs> I've heard of being on rails, but this is ridiculous. <laughs> Maybe I should stop trying to be fancy and just walk there.
And just in case you're wondering why I'm doing so many missions in this one coin, one coin, at uh, one level, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I have a problem. Uh, I, I do have a purpose here. And if you've played the game before, you probably know what it is. Either that or what I'm doing is actually pointless and I'm an idiot, but... <laughs> But there's the wilted sunflowers. And those sunflowers must not be allowed to wilt any longer. So like a majestic seal, Mario must slide in. Eh, shut up. Ha! Missed! My best guess is, oh, I'd love a dip. As in, like, they would like to be covered in water. Of course, this is more of a shower than a dip. Nah, I didn't mean ranch dip, you caught me. What the sunflowers really want is to go to Buffalo Wild Wings trademark. Either that or they just want to eat some like, I don't know, french fries or something, ketchup. Dip can mean many things, Ed Boy. Oh, it's gotta be on the sand. Right, right. Right. Poison for Cusco. Okay, I don't need the cutscene every time I kill one. It's it's fine. I get the idea. The way they like rear back before they jump on Mario is kind of adorable though. <laughs> you had to do was follow the damn mecha bowser cj i'm sure somebody has like modded delfino plaza into a grand theft auto game and if they haven't it's likely only because they had not thought of the idea before what is this oh he has something of ours Let us go get it! It's not actually ours, but we want it anyway. And it's certainly not his. Just standing in the middle of town, plain sight. Not so nimble when you're trying to make an omelette, are you? So here's a fun fact that you may not have known about this. Is that, uh... Metal Mario has a set series of, like, waypoints. Did I say Metal Mario? Uh, Shadow Mario. And even if he doesn't make it to one, he'll just teleport to the next one. Alright, so... Yoshi wants banana. We will provide that to him.
Yes. And now we can do things such as spray juice and eat birds. Yes, I wish I was kidding. And there are a few things we can do with this in the plaza. So this stuff we can do something about. And that leads to my one love. My one true love in this world. But there's more. There's more we can do. As the game demonstrated, we can also use it to go in that pipe on top there, but we're not gonna do that yet. We're gonna try and figure out like about the levels we already have open first. Yes, and Yoshi's power is that he can all he can eat things and he can also vomit on command. Okay. I just needed to, you know, demonstrate that. I think most people know about that. Oh, and Yoshi can also spin jump as well. Very useful because you no longer have access to the jetpack. Hang on. Oh, I think I saw an M that I haven't gotten yet. So as soon as we deal with this, we can get that. Yeah, to compensate for the fact that you have no access to Flood while you're on Yoshi, his spin jump is insane. Oh yeah, there's the M. Okay, now that we have Yoshi, we might be able to do the 100 coin mission in uh, Bianco. The one downside to Yoshi is that he cannot enter water. He is completely unwaterable. He gets soggy when in milk. Alright, now let's see if Yoshi's here now. So that's why I- that's the, the guy I was talking about before. Yeah, see, there he is. Rides at the start of the level. He wants a pineapple. A pineapple. So we gotta figure out where we can get him one of those. Probably in the lake area. So. So head over this way. Yeah, there's some fruits. Yeah, there we go. There's a pineapple. And now we just gotta take that back to Yoshi. Luckily, it doesn't matter if you fall in the water or anything. Mario will still hold on to the pineapple. However, it does matter if Yoshi falls in the water for reasons previously established. Also, I don't know if I demonstrated it, but when you're up here, you can see Delfino Plaza over there. You can see Rico Harbor, like a low-poly Rico Harbor, and there's Pinna Park. And I think if you look up somewhere, there's a, a later level. Anyway, let's go. And they even have the bongos for when you're on Yoshi. Truly, Mario World is back again. I don't know if Yoshi can stand on tight ropes, and at this point I'm too afraid to try. Actually, no, I can try here. No, he can't. Yeah, clean the man up by vomiting all over him.
Oh, and that turns him into a platform. I I forgot about that for a second. So can you just eat these guys or something? Yes, you can. What what happened? Oh, he uh. Oh, I missed his coin. Dang it. All right, so those guys are no longer things. Also, we can eat the bees. Now you might think to yourself, why? But there are reasons to eat the bees. First of all, coins can be had. And then secondly, like something with this hive, I think. I, I have no idea if I already said this, I already forgot, but. Unlike, uh, unlike, uh, with Flood, you rejuvenate Yoshi's, uh, juice by, um, eating fruit. I don't know why it took me so long to, uh, come up with that, but... Oh, yeah, see, this is why Yoshi is the big, uh, moneymaker right here. Because... All of these bees can be turned into coins. So that is a significant bonus. You know, if you can avoid getting hit by them for long enough. You know, I'm pretty sure I've seen a whole mess of like old... Oh yeah, and you can get a boot coin if you eat all of them. I'm pretty sure I've seen a whole mess of cartoons that had the main character eating bees. Well, eating is maybe a strong term. It's more like he had bees fly forcibly into his mouth against his will. Okay, Mario, cool story. Haha, <laughs> what the story, Mario? Yeah, so this is where the bulk of the 100 coin star comes from. So just gotta keep moving. Just can't let anything break your stride. Can't let anything hold you down. Gotta keep on moving. Oh, that one gives you a 1-up instead of a blue coin. But it's still useful. But we're not done yet. Can go through here. Yep. Very glitchily, but it can be done. Yeah, the other thing is that, uh... Well, yeah, that, but... I think Yoshi can eat... Yeah, Yoshi can eat these butterflies. This guy just does not discriminate. He will eat literally everything. Yes, Super Mario Sunshine teaches the alphabet. Okay, you can't do, like, the... the spin thing, unfortunately. But we can get off of Yoshi and do it. And then hop back on. Oh, and it just... it just kind of gives you the life, I think. Which is very nice of it. Yoshi's running low on juice, I think. So we should probably soon go rejuvenate him. Oh, can Yoshi eat those? Yes, he can. Will he? I don't know, but he can. You can get a nice, good one-up mushroom out of it.
I mean, I understand why they did it, though. Because you kind of got to have some kind of flood substitute. Okay, I gotta, I gotta go rejuvenate my dinosaur before he dies of starvation. Oh, oh, okay. Oh. It's okay, Yoshi. You'll, you're gonna be okay, man. Everything is gonna be all right. Oh, bees are back. Are the bees back? No, it looks like these have no bees. No bees. Yeah, no, no bee. No bees. Uh, the lore reason is, um, Mario. That's, that's, that's the lore reason. Give me the... What are you doing? Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, at this rate, it's like Yoshi's can be found wherever we dang well feel like. <laughs> Shigeru Miyamoto, 2001. Okay, there we go. <laughs> There's probably not much use to having Yoshi much longer. Oh, blue, co blue coin. Okay, I missed those other coins, I think. But it should be alright. So let's 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 get that bread. Let's go. Let's slide let's slide off the cliff. Beating the mission is overrated. I wanna slide off the cliff. Come on, man, you know how hard it is to get a Japanese man to speak into a microphone and then pitch him up. You kidding me? They don't got the budget for that. What, you think we're made of money? <laughs> um, I might stream Yoshi's Story one day, but I probably stream... Island first. Who knows, I might do that uh, in the near future. But I have a different uh, Super Nintendo game in mind. One that is very near and dear to my heart and also the rest of the internet's collective hearts. And they never shut up about it, but that's okay, because it, it deserves it. They don't shut up about it, but that's okay. But Yoshi's Island could be a possibility. 
get that like what super FX chip going on. I mean, not technically all stars, but I have streamed lost levels before. I need to, I need to do it again. I mean, not that I know for a fact I'm ever gonna be able to beat that legit, but I don't, I don't know. It has claimed my honor, but unlike, uh, unlike Mario One, it, it's kind of claimed everybody's honor, so it's all right. Now, excuse me while I. Try to jump off this clip and have an aneurysm. You know, if I was smarter, I would just do this. <laughs> but when did I say I was smart? So you got a rocket. So that's cool and bodacious. Alright, cool, cool wind. But I'm in control here. You cannot defeat me in my own domain. Where's that coin? Oh, you gotta jump for that coin. But we'll have to see if Langton was right about it booting me out of the level. Ah, no. Nope. Deny. Oh, and unlike Mario 64, where it just kind of spawns where you are. Uh, it, it went over there in this game. This decidedly not Mario 64 game. I gotta stand up for a second. Ow. Ow, pop. Okay, well that wasn't as bad as this I was like, but yeah. Enjoy the sultry tone of Mario Sunshine. Where was it? Like over there? Yeah. Okay, right he was. Right he was. Yeah, so there's no reason to, like, make a, a detour during another mission to get it. Oh, sorry about that, my bad. Now let's get the actual mission. And then we'll be done with this level, probably. Alright, let's get down there. Oh no, but those guys are back. I don't like those guys. Okay, I, I think I feel a little bit better now. Yeah. 
No, get wrecked. Become wrecked. Uh, yes, there are secret red coin missions in the secret, secret level, secret. Nope, nope. Nope, nope. No, no. No, 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 no. Yeah, I was close to 100% once and then. I was I was emulating the game and then my SD card corrupted itself, so that was fun. I sure am glad that uh, the universe does not want me to be happy. But yeah, I didn't talk about the rocket nozzle, but I'm sure you can pretty much piece together what that does. You can have Mario, like, take a big old, like, fart off of this rail. Not, this isn't a rail. This is, uh, like a trapeze. Oh, Mario Sunshine's got some glitches, I will say that. Also, I like how there's fall damage, but it is extremely easy to break your fall. Like, possibly easier than Mario 64. Because, like, in Mario 64, you had to, like, ground pound or something. And this, you can just, you can flop forward, you can, uh... You can, like, um... What, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Okay, water bug. Water bug. Speaking of Mario 64, water bug. I showed off a fun glitch in the last stream where I ran into a pole and clipped out of bounds. So that's fun. Like, but not not sarcastically though. It, it actually is. <laughs> Oh, oh, wait, wait. I spy with my little eye. Something blue. Yeah, I think I mentioned it once before, but just in case. It turns out that's actually a pretty well-known thing, ending up in a wet, dry world because uh, you messed up the long jump but it was still it was still funny because I had I didn't know about it before so it amused me greatly Ch get a load of that guy dancing he's a dancing machine watch him get down I need to figure out where that other blue not blue coin red coin is Yes, I clipped it, because initially I thought I had made an earth-shattering discovery. I don't know what to say about some of this, I just... I am bad at Mario. I need to get up to the high zone. I need to time my rocket better. Oh, okay, so... Probably...
Oh, get red coin. Red coin. Red. Bread coin. Let's get this bread. I'm sorry, Miles. I was born with a inability to recognize that I'm... I don't know. I don't know where this sentence is going. I keep doing it. Okay. I have somehow retained my on the tightrope ability and I went the wrong freaking way. I I mock Mario in his pain. What kind of man am I? Okay, now we gotta go to the lighthouse. The lighthouse. Alright, so now you guys do not have to look at Bianco Hills anymore. So, where, ne where next? We gotta do all of them eventually, so just where next? Oh, and we also, we unlock that place. We have a lot of choices. Too late, I'm going to Rico Harbor. Because I have decided suddenly that I want to go to Rico Harbor. The caged shine sp sprite. I'll go to Noki Bay next. But first, there is a Shine Sprite. It is caged. And now we must go this way. <laughs> we must run off the platform. Okay, so we could, we could do this platforming challenge. Or, we could uh, go up here instead. And clip through you, clip through it, you know, just like I intended. Just like I totally remembered would happen. You probably have just swam over here. You know, swam. That's a good word. Swum. S -s 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 Swim. Swag. Swaggle. Alright, so we don't like that guy, so we're just gonna steer clear of him. This really is the Mario, the Mario World 3D game. Truly. Oh, you made it all the way up here. Hey, by the way, have you spoken to the guy on the roof over there? The guy on the roof? No, I haven't. I'll do it. I'll do that. Guy on the roof. Guy on the roof. I was told to speak with you. Hey, it's just like the movies, you know, the scene where something's on the manhole and they can't get it open. <laughs> I have 49 different accents all at the same time.
<laughs> I have never seen a movie where that happens. You know what? Me neither. But there's a there's a blue coin over there, so I must risk life and limb for it. Must be one of them Japanese films. Okay, yeah, I've seen the rocket before, thank you. But I mean, I'll take any opportunity to save. But uh, there is a coin on the lighthouse. What witch I want. So we're gonna go get that right now. Alright, now, now, now that I have detoured our entire venture, there's another one. <laughs> if I was aiming for the lower one, I would have got it too. But, you know, sometimes you just gotta make do with what you got. And just kind of do a water fart on the ground. Could you not? Could you just don't? Could you- could you don't? Jane, get me off this crazy thing! Ah, uh, the old- the old water fart trick. They fall for that one every time. Oh, there's one over there too. The old blue coin trick. I fall for that one every time. The wind is aggressive. Let's just get up here. You know, just pretend like nothing happened. Like, did I jump off? No, I didn't jump off. We didn't lose any progress. Now, excuse me while Ma Mario hits terminal velocity. I mean... In, in, uh, to add some credibility to that idea, you never see it attacking them. Wario taught Mario all about the butt flame. The butt flame <laughs> re-entering the atmosphere. So let's go over to Noki Bay. And where's that big old shine sprite? Shine. Guidebook says it's like the shining eye of Isle Delfino. Wait, are you... Sure is dark. Is this daytime? Are all cities dark? So wait, are you are you guys like Piantas that aren't from here? Is anybody from here? Uncork the waterfall. Welcome, Master Mario, I presume. We have heard much about you, yes, and all of it's good. 
As for me, I'm just an old man who loves nothing but fishing. But lately, I have had a terrible problem. Please look up there. I don't know who did it, but someone corked our waterfall. This, no doubt, is why our lovely bay has become polluted. And not at all because we keep taking a dump in the water. Our trash, that is. Dumping our trash in the water. Not like... <laughs> laying on the dramatics to get Mario to do it. It's like, it's like alright old man, I, I said I'd do it. You don't, you don't gotta lay it on that thick. I mean, spoilers, we haven't been to this level yet. You know, if anybody, God forbid, has not played Mario Sunshine. Oh wait, am I actually supposed to be doing this? But, uh, spoilers, there is a toilet. There are toilets in this game, in a later level. See, okay, you're, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to put water in this pot. But why do that when you can just, like, you know, jump and do the jetpack? You know? There's no need. There's no need for any of it. Oh, right. I remember now why I thought, like, oh, can you go up here? Because, like, you, you clean this off, right? And then, no? No? Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah, see, that. I think that, that is what I would wall jump up. Egad has invented paint that eats matter. Frankly, I'm terrified of the possibilities. Luckily, it seems to non-fatally eat matter, but still. You know, it's surprising that Mario just doesn't get covered in this stuff, and it's like game over, because he gets sucked into the ground. Whale. Alright, let's- come on, come on, let's get through here. Let's get through here. Nope, no Mario. Mo no Mario, this isn't a slide. Oh, okay. I thought I had it in the bag. That The jump, that is. I thought I had that jump settled. Mario, don't please just don't walk off. The yes, the shadows are dark blue, and also Mario's shadow is made out of circles. You may not have noticed, but it is, in fact, very circly. What is, what's funny about that is that Galaxy used a more, like, real-time sort of solution. Which, on one hand, is cool, but on the other hand, it also means it's not as high-res as this. And I've been attacked by a bird. First, let's go down here. And ignore our objective. Ari or objective. Oh, I didn't actually mean to do that. Yeah, so Galaxy Shadows, while they look more like Mario, they also are a bit more 
silly. No, that's not gonna work. Okay. Oh, the rocket. That's what you come all the way over here for. Well, maybe, maybe more. Maybe, yep, there's a, there's a little something more. But now that I have the rocket, it may prove harder to get it than initially thought. And then there's that one, too. Truly, I am swimming in the blue. But unfortunately, the game decides... Now, let's have a boxing glove. Oh, hang on. Um, I wasn't looking, uh, it says somebody just followed me on Twitch. Did the notification thing show up on stream? I haven't actually been able to test to see if that works. Actually, I did not put it on this source. <laughs> Whoops. I'll have to make sure to do that next time. When I'm when I'm done with this stream, it's a little too late to do it now, but But hey, uh Let's see who who was it? Uh, it says Deity901. So thank you for following me, sir and or madam. Or, you know, other. Alright, so... As we all know, springboards are dry clean only. I know there's like a, a glitch you can do here. Oh, you gotta you gotta hit it just right. No, that's too much space given. I'm gonna try this for just a second. Eh. something. At least I think this is where you do this. Maybe I need to be pointed more towards the actual, like, corner here. Like, eh. Uh, or maybe you're right about... Eat, nah, it's Mario, quit, quit snapping yourself to eight degree angles. Just a little bit more, and then I'll move on. Yes! I did it! And I've sw swam back into bounds, but I still did it. And I'm going to die. Ahoy, SpongeBob. <laughs> I've clipped myself. Ahoy, SpongeBob. I've clipped myself out of bounds and I'm going to die. <laughs> and there's some neat things you can do with that, but I won't waste your time messing around with it anymore. Luckily, we can just use uh, this to get back up. 
again, like, no progress was lost at all. Is there any way in OBS to just have, like, a global source? Like, kind of like a persistent object in Game Maker, but, you know, stream. Like, you know, like a, a source that automatically adds itself to any, any scenes that are created. Uh, okay, interesting. I'll have to look into that. I'm lucky that most of the people in my chat know <laughs> what what a persistent object is. Alright, we can go for a little bit longer. Where are we going next? We're going back to Noki Bay. We're going to, like, that level up there. We could go to uh, Gelato. We got options. We got options. Alright, Gelato Beach. To Gelato we gelat go. And then a bunch of notifications pop up on screen saying that about a dozen people have unfollowed me for that joke. Wiggler Ahoy- oh, yeah, that's right, we knocked that off of the tower. He's mad, he's a mad boy. But we know how to deal with mad boys around here. We gotta wait. We gotta wait for him to come this way. And then we gotta stomp on this very specific area. This very, very specific area of his body. A particularly challenging boss. Oh, no. Nope. You just gotta, like, be able to read when he's actually coming over. he'll come over here and I'll be ready for him I'll be ready for you when you do okay no oh we gotta go for a different one where'd he go Okay.
You can keep going. I'm trying, my, my end goal here is to get the music to sound. Uh, just like a blip that loops in three seconds. That's my ultimate goal. Okay, I'm done, I'm done. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, I didn't really touch upon that. Uh, a lot of the music in Mario Sunshine is actually synthesized. Which is funny, because, uh... It doesn't sound like it, so they did a very good job, I think. Very high quality samples. Okay, where now? So use here to see what all we got and see our totals. You know what? Let's go to Serena Beach. I I'm feeling in a Serena Beach kind of mood. But first, we gotta. Uh, no, actually, did I already get the, the pineapple? twist is, though, if you send a floppy letter to me, I am actually equipped to read it. Ah! The Manta Storm. Oh, this level looks so good. Also, it, it's a GameCube controller. Yeah, I managed to find a copy of, uh, Wolfenstein on a floppy, so that was neat. And I got a USB floppy drive with which to read it. I think there's something out to see here. And, I, yeah, there we are behind Pinna Park. Which is just so wonderful. Oh, there it is. There it is. There's the blue, the blue bull. A lovely night on the beach. The sun, the sand, the electric goo. Maybe I've been going to some bad beaches. The 
which is that. Loudly press the R button and get that out of the way. I wonder what the goop tastes like, haha, <laughs> asking for a friend. Oh, he actually just called me Mario. Finally, some freaking respect around here. I'll have two number nines. Yeah, I couldn't imagine why that would be. Could not tell you. I was under the roof, so I didn't get drenched in slime. Yeah, see, that guy gets it. What? The hotel's vanished? What does that mean? Hey, what's going on? What's all this nonsense? You, fix it now! What, what am I supposed to do? Do they know? Oh, please tell me that my nightmare is over. You can save me. I don't know why, but you just look very uh, capable to me. Listen, it all started around noon. This giant manta shaped thing showed up. It was paper thin floating silhouette. It came and covered the hotel grounds in it, this electric group. Then all the horror, my beautiful hotel, my poor building, it sank in the middle of that awful ooze. Why me? Why? Now I've got the staff cleaning up, but where's my hotel? What am I supposed to do? I can't just sit back and Ah, uh, it's back! The customer ghoul to do something! Alright, real talk. I was pretty terrified of this boss when I was a little kid. Good thing that the thing I've been using this entire game is, is well capable of stopping this foe. Oh no, I'm getting yeeted like crazy. Quit yeeting. I do not appreciate being yeeted. Also under there is a safe spot. Like like the guy illustrated before. They are dividing into smaller units. Of course. I need to grab some coin, probably. Oh, okay. <laughs> Save me, Mr. Barhand. So I just gotta kind of like clean up this mess. There's like a mess of the place. Ah, uh, yeah. See, I think this is the part that spooked me the most when I was uh, a little kid. Is the part where you get them all down to like the lowest size unit and then they're just like all going after you.
With the yeeting. Well, if they're all after me, they're not doing a particularly great job about it. All right, I get it. Okay, there's coins in the trees if you really need them. There we go. <laughs> Taken care of. The hotel's back! This is just crazy! Is this, is this a prank? Don't try to fool me. Yes, this is a amazing practical joke. You know, the fact that there still hasn't been a Mario Sunshine Splatoon crossover is frankly absurd. And I, I will not stand for it. And now I think we have time for one or two more missions. I'll just do... I'll do one here. The Hotel Lobby Secret. And now... A very ungoopified version. What the hold up? Can I get checked in here or what? I'm utterly exhausted. Please let me rest. Oh yeah, and you can uh, do do this number. Put out all fires. Just to be a jerkwad. But here's why. Blue coins can be anywhere. The, the moral of the story, I got that one somehow without even putting out the fire. Excuse me, gentlemen and madam, but I must put out the flame. Here, have a coin. And you will find the blue coins, and you will find the blue coins, and you will find the blue coins! They're just everywhere. Spray everything. Spray everything in the game. And then you may find some. See, like, there's one right there. Just blue coins out the, the waz. Scott the waz. Blue coins are made out of the bones of Scott Wozniak. Now, why are his bones blue? That's a good question, and one I do not have an answer for. Alright, well, now that I've done all that... 
Nope, coins are made out of bones. Hey, um, it's Mario, right? Yeah, Mario. I forgot the voice I did for this guy last time. Listen, I have a feeling you can help me out again. The hotel, well, it's full It's full of ghosts. So, uh, could you maybe just look, look, come inside, please? I can tell you're a miracle worker. Don't be so modest. I mean, he's not wrong. Oh man, I love the dopey booze in this game. Look at him. Alright, so you're supposed to climb the hotel. But I'm gonna try to do something else. I'm gonna try to flex. Okay. Well, I gotta... I gotta watch out for the ghosts while I'm trying to flex. Oh, okay. Actually, no, you are supposed to spray the ghosts in order to get up. But you can also just wall jump if you're clever. If you're... if you're good enough. Come and have a go if you think you're hard enough. Hang on, I will flex. It just... There you go, there's my flex. See, there was a flex. It just, it just took some time for me to get that flex prepared. And now we must deal with stews and watermelons. A normal Saturday night. And, oh yeah, that's right. You cannot, uh, you cannot long jump, so you have to jump on these guys. Which I have somehow done. Without failure. Which means I will fail at something completely different. And now, to fail at something completely different. Okay, one coin. Are there ever any blue coins in these? In these levels? I don't think so, but I could be very mistaken. Oh, oh no. I have failed to jump once again. I have soiled the good Krusty Krab name. You know, you could also probably just like... Okay, no you can't. <laughs> I mean, if you did a double jump, maybe. Yeah, it, it feels very weird to not be able to do a long jump after playing Last Impact so much. <laughs> good, good jump, Mario. <laughs> Guess I'm blaming this on Mario. I accept no responsibility. <laughs> yeah, I I jumped at that guy and then I had second thoughts. I'm like, oh, I'm not gonna make it, and and then Mario spun, which I forgot he could do midair. Not to mention, the angle being slightly skewed does not help me feel more confident. Also, I wish these bra these brakes did not brick my momentum. Uh, uh, uh. Sand is scary. 
You heard it here first. Okay. The pyramid. We made it, Jotaro. We made it to Egypt. You know what? How about this? We'll finish off by doing a couple of uh, the secrets that this affords us. Wow, rude. Wow, even more rude. Nah, man, this isn't... Pachinko is not a turbo nozzle. Gotta get the rocket nozzle for that one. I mean, mostly this. The, pretty much the only secret level that uses the turbo nozzle. To tell you the truth, for a second I couldn't tell if it was the rocket or the turbo... You know, I feel like this is a recurring issue. A recurring issue of me, like, pressing the jump button, but doing it way too late. Because I want to jump close to the edge, man. I don't want to, like, jump too early. I can't wait to not grab the Shine Sprite. Okay, what you want to do, I think, is... Well, yeah, like that. Th that works. I was gonna ground pound, but you know, whatever gets the shine. Whatever butters the toast. Alright, so now you can just go over here, grab this in. Yeah, so you can just, you know, use it wherever. Free Shine Sprite, just completely free. Yahoo! Butter Toast. Delfino Plaza has many doors, it boy. Oh yeah, there's like a... Oh yeah, there's like the thing back there. I'll get that in a second too. Yeah, the turbo nozzle, in my opinion, is honestly the uh, 
least useful of the nozzles, unfortunately. Which is a shame, because you'd think it really would be a lot more useful. Like, I mean, you can, you can go mad fast, yo. But, you know, it's not really required for a whole lot. So, what can you do? What can you do? Rip, rip turbo nozzle. You know what, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it now. Let's give it a go. Might not finish it this time, but let's just, let's try it. Try the worst mission in the game. Because, will Mario survive? I don't know. Because the game... You know, the hand of God reaches down and chooses where you're going to go. See, look, I'm trying to go back. Trying to go backwards. Trying to go back. Won't let me do it. Will not let me do it. You're going in that hole. Not an innuendo. Just go in the- go in the hole! Yeah, it's like- it's- it's like they started designing a pachinko level, and then they were like... Well, gee whiz guys, this isn't gonna work with Mario's physics. And then Miyamoto just came in to the studio, the game studio drunk, and he said, um, Make new physics! And they're like, Mr. Miyamoto, what are you talking about? Make new physics so that the pachinko will work. Uh, yeah, man, I remember like really wacky secret cheats like unlocking Luigi in Mario 64, unlocking Waluigi in Mario 64 DS, because Luigi actually was... actually was in the game <laughs> at that point, so they had to come up with somebody new. Uh, getting the Triforce in Ocarina. Unlocking Bilbo Baggins in Ancient Keys. Alright, I have spawned the shine. Now can I get to it? Will the game allow me... Yeah. So, as completely expected, um, Bianco Hills, <laughs> Bianco Hills, uh, secret, actually impossible. Uh, Pachinko, that is terrible and I hate it. First try. The counter curse is real. It is scientifically proven. 
anyway, that'll be that'll be it for me for now. I think that's a good place to stop. See you.